Hello everyone, so today uh, we are making a wide leg plazo pants for six to seven years old. Okay, so the total length I want ready is 27 inches. And so first I'm going to straighten the fabric from the bottom. Okay, so my pattern is going this way. The, all the flowers are facing this way. So that's why I'm marking from here. So I want 26, uh, 27 inches ready. Then I need a one inches for fold. And then I need two inches for the belt. So total I'm cutting is 30 inches. So right now the width is 11 inches on fold which is total of 22 inches so first this is the mark where the pants are going to start from and then i'm going to mark on two inches right here then from here i am marking on nine inches or you can from this corner you can mark two inches inside like this and the length from here from the belt mark right here is going to be on eight inches for crotch area two inches join all the marks make a slight curve like this i am not going to cut anything extra except i have to cut this part only so i'm just going to cut like half an inch or 0.25 inches just to cut the edges so my fabric will be even and then after i am going to cut this And this is the belt mark. I am making a small notch here. Now open this and sew both crotch area. And then I'll be folding the hem. Now I'm attaching this ribbon. The reason why I'm attaching this ribbon because this pattern is all over the place, like it's too much of the pattern. And uh, I'm going to stitch the top with the same pattern. So I just wanted some color blocking. So this is how it looks from the back and the front. After I'm done with the ribbon stitching, I am going to sew the sides and I am taking one inch is margin, all right? Now I'm going to stitch the belt and this is two inches wide and then I'm going to leave like one inch open so I can insert the elastic. I'm using one inch wide elastic so this casing is good for me. And it can go according to the waist size of your daughter uh, once you insert it with the help of safety pin i did it and once you're done just stitch the seams and then 
stitch the middle seam so it will be the elastic will be intact once everything is done i will show you the final result all right guys so these are the final results and this is how it looks like it looks so cute and adorable and this is the waistline this is how it looks and this is really nice for the summer my daughter she she can wear it with the t-shirt with uh, uh, I am going to stitch a top with that so she can use it with the multiple uh, she has multiple options to wear with so thank you for watching the video uh, please do subscribe to my channel I'll see you guys next time bye now